Hey guys, it's me, Tawazman, um, and my emulator isn't working. No, nah, not actually. Um, we're gonna be continuing Pokemon Red version. Oh boy, fun! And to recap, uh, yay! Well, let's just go heal up. So I'm actually trying a new strategy with them off. the headphones I'm using. Because they have a mic attached to the headphones. I'm putting my headphones around my ears and then hoping that the game audio reaches the microphone. And same with my talking. Um, when I look at the audio, um, probably later tonight, um, I'll see how it goes. And I keep saying, um... Like usual. But it's time for the best part. The best part about any Pokemon game. Grinding. I'm just gonna get him to like level 11. And then I'll fight the trainer in Brock's gym. Oh yeah. This part of... This part after Viridian Forest... It uses the encounters from Route 2. Give me a second. There we are. We're in Viridian. Not Viridian City. Viridian Forest. Give me an encounter. Give me... Thank you. A wheel. Good thing it can't poison me. I should really actually um, uh, put horn attack in the first position. Is yeah, shift is yeah. Sh my sh shift key is select. I know the encounter rate is high as shit here. Or is that Mount- No, that's Mount Moon. I think at least. I don't know. Yay, let's go fight the trainer. Pokemon logic. When you want an encounter, you don't get it. When you don't want an encounter, you get it. At least give me like a fucking Pikachu or something. Cause that's optimal. Do I need to heal? Oh, yeah, I did use a lot of PP. Does Horn Attack have uh, 20 PP? 25. I'll go heal anyway. Because... I'm not grinding my Bulbasaur to level 13 so it can get Vine Whip. I'm probably just gonna go at it with level 12 Pokemon and the only three attacks are... Tackle and horn attack. So, Nidoran's gonna be the star player. Um, there's a Mart here, and it is true. Yes, you can buy potions! Yes! And then I screamed like an autistic child. Awakening. They're Jigglypuff on the next route, so yeah, I, you could take a few. Again, you don't need Burn Heal. Actually, you might. Um, if you po if you pick the Bulbasaur, and this, actually no, you don't even need it. You don't because I'm pretty sure the one in Cerulean has one. 
up here is the Pewter Museum of Science. Let's just go in. Fifty dollars, fifty cents for a child's ticket. Hell yeah. So this really doesn't have much of my story significance. That's one magnificent fossil. Aerodactyl fossil. Primitive and rare Pokemon. And that's Kabutops. Primitive and rare Pokemon. Wait, did that also say primitive, primitive and rare? Yeah, apparently. Set up. Meteorite that fell on Mount Moon. Moonstone? You're gonna need it soon. July 20th, 1969. Moon landing. I bought a color TV to watch it. Moonstone? What's so special about it? A lot. We have a space exhibit now. Yo, that space shuttle, dude. I, yeah, Pikachu soon. I promise. What? You want a Pikachu? Oh, that's your dad. I thought it was your boyfriend. Whatever. So, other than that, there really isn't much to see. This game. It's just kind of a cool exhibit. You could walk around, exhibit two fossils and uh, moonstone. Learn about space and shit. Um, this girl wants a Pikachu. Just go catch one in Viridian. In Viridian Forest. I mean, it's a bit rare, but it was good. Take plenty of time to look. Wait. And over there, they're working with a fossil of some sort. Which you cannot get to because... Um, tiny bush. Is there a secret item here? Nope. Apparently not. But yeah. So let's go take on the gym trainer. Not the gym leader. Gym trainer. I want to be level 12 for the gym leader. Stop right there, kid. You're still light years from facing Barack. How many are we talking about? 5, 10, 15? I don't know. Diglett, um, can't catch these for a while, but the summary is it's fast as shit, but everything else about it sucks. Except its attack. attack its attack is okay. Also, its HP stat is 10. Base HP, not actual HP. It doesn't fucking kill. And we're gonna get a lot of experience. Never mind, we don't get a lot of experience. Up, oh, still enough for level 12. <laughs> Stand true. Hell yeah, I'll change. Let's go, Bulbapedia. Let's just leech the seed, the son of a bitch. And then spam tackle. Um, if you're playing red version like me, you can't catch Sandshrew. But if you're playing blue and yellow, I think? I'm not so sure about that, but... I think if, you, if you're playing blue or yellow, you can catch Sandshrew on the next route. I'm not going to summarize it until then, because it's there's really not a lot to talk about about it. Also, nice wording. Let's go speed through the rest of it. Through the rest of it. Two hundred nineteen experience and level twelve. Yay! So I could take on the gym leader right now. Yeah, it measures distance. Dipshit. Let, let's talk to the. Oh, let's see these um, statues. Peter City Pokemon Gym Leader Brock. Wintering Trainers. Ash. Hiya, I can tell you what it, it takes to become a Pokemon champ. 
I'm no trainer, but I can tell you how to win. Let me take you to the top. Fuck you. It's a free service. Let's get happening. The first Pokemon out in the match is at the top of the Pokemon list. By changing the order of Pokemon, matches can be made easier. Um, is it? Um, is it something different if I say yes? Apparently not. I wanted the fucking, um, uh, yo, champ in the making guy from fucking, like, um, uh, gold and silver. That was, that shit was the best. I, I, I can rate that guy 10 out of 10. Because he's just so optimistic about everything. I love him. No homo. And so, we're gonna be fighting Brock now. I'm probably gonna s mm. Let's put Bulbapedia on front, because it does have Leech Seed. Yeah. And the Gym Leaders don't switch any Pokemon. <laughs> This trainer is completely optional. I just fought him for the XP. I'm Brock. I'm damn it. I don't know how to do the anime voice. The only line I know is the uh, I know. I'll use this frying pan as a drying pan. <laughs> that shit's the best. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter City's gym leader. Pewter's gym leader. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. Rock and ground, but close enough because there are no pure rock types in gen run this one you still want to challenge me fine then show me your move i <laughs> show me your best all right brocky boy he covers up his brock hard nipples brock sent out geodude i'm pretty sure it has tackle um tackle and something it's level 10 in yellow also, why didn't I not? Yeah, this battle is going to take a long time. Good thing I have potions. Now nah, I'm just going to speed through this. Because basically that's all. This Pokemon is not hard by any means. It's just very hard to destroy. Because... If you're kind of under level like me, all you have are physical moves. And since Bulbapedia's Bulbasaur's um, uh, attack is lower than its special, it just takes very, very long. How much PP have I used? Nine, alright. Alright, that's that. I uh, have 220 XP. Onyx. Um, I think it has Tackle, Bide, and Screech. It's level 14. Um, in level in the um, uh, yellow, it's level 12, and I think it has um, uh, one extra move. I forget what it is though. There's this thing on my uh, laptop keyboard. And I'm um, uh, just looking at this thing. Alright, so it is Screech. I'm, I'm just using the here. Holy shit. Well, hold the fuck up. Because I'm pretty sure if you uh, switch out, all your uh, stat changes are gone. I will give you one point of damage. Perfect. Let's switch to Unicorn. And then, uh, I have a potion. You will do two damage. Eight damage. Good enough. Yeah, so it does eliminate all stat changes. Be prepared to do ten damage. 16 damage. Fucking heal again. I 
And again, this thing is a bit of a bitch if you don't know what you're doing. And if you don't have any special moves, which I don't think you will unless you're overleveled. Yeah, this thing's gonna be a bit of a pain in the ass. It just keep spamming moves. Did you just get fucking two crits in a row? Now I gotta fucking heal again. Because this fight is a bit bullshit. I might have under leveled a little bit. Be slower. Get him. Get him. Yeah. All right, that's good. Level 13. This move would have been fucking great for this battle, but because I'm me and I'm a stubborn little bitch, I did not do it. It's proof of your victory. Here's the boulder badge. I get the boulder badge. This does not go in your key item. That's an official Pokemon League badge. It bears Pokemon become more powerful. The technique with Flash can be used at any time. I get a uh, 1300 for winning. Wait, take this with you. TM34. Um, it contains a technique that can be taught to a Pokemon. TM is good only once, so when you use it, it to teach a new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. It contains Bide. Bide is garbage. You basically absorb damage and then deal it back double. It's garbage. It is literally free money. Alright, so... I, I guess that's a good amount of ending point. I'm just gonna speed uh, to the Pokemon. I mean, like... We defeated Brock, and I'm pretty sure that's already fucking big as is, so... Next time on Pokemon Red... We're gonna be going on Route 3, fighting a bunch of trainers. See you guys then.